Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can easily download and install the current Java version that is Java 17.0.2. With that, we will also see a sample example. So let's begin. At first, we will download the current Java version. Go to the browser. I am using Chrome, you can use any browser. On Google, type Oracle Java. Press enter. On pressing enter, the official website is visible. Click on it. On clicking on the right, you can see download Java is visible. Click on it. After clicking, you can see Java 17. And when you will go below, it is showing that this is Java 17.0.2. So Linux, Mac OS and Windows versions, we want Windows 10. Here it is. We want the installer, exe file, here it is. Click on it. So we have clicked on it. It is downloading. 152 MB. Let's wait. So guys, the download completed. Now double click on the exe file. Minimize this. So guys, the installation started. You can see 17.0.2 JDK. Click on next. Herein, you can see it will get installed under program files. And the following is the path. If you want to change the path, click here. But it's fine for me. Here it is written that this JDK includes JRE also. So you don't need to install JRE separately for Java. Okay guys, it's only, it will only take 420 MB. Click on next. Now the installation started. Guys, you can see Java JDK 17.0.2 successfully installed. Click on close. Now guys, let us see wherein we have installed Java. C drive, program files. If you remember, it was here Java. And we have our path Java 7, JDK 17.0.2. Go to bin. Copy this path. Copy this path. Minimize. Now let us go to start and set the path. Go to start, type environment variables. Here in under edit the system environment variables, click on open. Now under system properties, advanced tab, go to environment variables. Here in go to system variables and here in go to path. Double click on it. After double clicking, go to new and just paste it. Right click and paste the same path. So we pasted the same bin path. That's it. Now you can click on OK. Herein, you can also set the Java underscore home path. For that, just click on new. Herein set variable Java underscore home. Under variable value, right click and paste the same path, but remove the bin now. Click on OK. OK and the last OK. Now we have successfully installed the current Java version. Let us verify. Go to start, type cmd, click on open to open it. Now you can see command prompt is visible. Let us type a command java space hyphen hyphen version and press enter so that we can verify that we have successfully installed java or not. Press enter. On pressing enter you can see we have successfully installed java 17.0.2. We can also check the java compiler. Java C space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. You can see 17.0.2 that means we have successfully installed it. So guys now we will see how we can create a sample program in Java. Let's say I'll create a file or folder here. I'll create a folder. Let's say the name I'll give is Amit programs. Okay. Now I'll double click, right click here, go to new, create a text document. Now I'll name it, let's say I'll name it to demo dot, I'll change the extension by removing TST and typing Java. Because I hope you know for Java program, we need to have a dot Java extension file. Now when I'll keep the cursor here or press enter, it will ask that you need to change the file extension or not. Let's do it. Herein you can see you want to change the file extension, you want to change it. Yes. Now we have a Java file. Herein you can see it is written Java source file. When you keep the cursor, you can see it is a Java source file. Right click and open with any editor. You can open with notepad from here or 
you can open with any editor like notepad plus plus i'll open with notepad plus plus now here it is guys now we will run our first java program always remember guys the name of the class here should be same with the name of the java file that means demo.java means our class will be demo now let's write a quick code so guys now you can see we wrote our first program so here it is uh, class name is demo within public static void main we wrote this we wrote two lines for printing system dot out dot println use for printing here in string args is basically for command line arguments if you want to learn more about command line arguments you can refer the link in the description of this video so we wrote two lines we will print this study with the java 17 tutorial and our first java 17 program here in you can see now i'll go to file and save it file save now we have this link on the desktop minimize this here in this is the path copy this path now go here first we will reach the desktop or we can straight away go to the file by just copying this path so i guess this is the best way right minimize now since we are changing the path i'll write cd that is change directory when i'll right click it will automatic paste the same path here you can see it has pasted the same path press enter now you can see we have reached the amit programs now type dir command here you can see dir command shows that amit programs is having demo dot java file here it is here it is visible demo dot java now to run your first java program type java c demo dot java the file name here java c means java compiler press enter here you can see we did an we did an error so go to the code here you can see we missed a parenthesis now it's fine go to file save now since we did the changes we need to compile it again type the same java c space demo dot java and press enter now you can see there is no error we successfully compiled it now to run it type java java space demo that's it and press enter on pressing enter you can see we successfully ran our first java program here and you can see so guys in this video we saw how we can easily download and install java 17.0.2 If you like the video do subscribe to our channel Amit Things